what what's it like at that level to be you know you you all american you're you're obviously all four years so your freshman year you were you were the first first freshman all american on the club team what's your experience like i talked to you about the schottenstein center and i can only i know that from being there what's your experience like in allen texas at the national tournament Ooh, it, it's it's crazy because after experiencing that um, that feeling from senior year of high school, and the unfortunate, like well, not unfortunately, unfortunately, my my first time going to the state tournament was my senior year, and I thought that was the only time that I was going to be experiencing that big stage. And after I fell just short of placing and being as competitive as I am, I wanted to. I wanted to do that again. Like, and when I found the opportunity by chance at Ohio State, I uh, I took it. And Allen, Texas, I mean, going to the state tournament and then going to Allen, Texas, uh, they're they're pretty similar, man. They're mm -hmm. it's uh, the NCWA national tournament is no joke, um, especially when you get into those top ten top ten seeds for each weight class. Uh, those are, I mean, those are really really good guys and great competition um allen texas is is uh really special and it's another shell shock honestly <laughs> uh you know when you step out there there's uh i believe there's a dozen mats on the floor and mm -hmm. you're competing in an arena and you got the banners all over uh very similar to being in the schottenstein and uh you got all eyes on you. It's it's. I, I'm not going to forget any of those experiences, and I can recall each one from my senior year of high school to my senior year of college. I can recall all those times I was in the one time I was in the Schottenstein, and then the the four times I was in Allen, Texas. It's uh, I mean, they're they're great experiences. I'm never going to forget. So you you graduated. You're a grad student still, or you you're done. I'm done. I'm done with okay. my undergrad. Yeah. Yep. And what are you what are you doing now? You're pharmacy tech, is that right? Yep. Pharmacy technician at Ohio State. I uh I actually worked as a student at Ohio State, had a great student job, and I uh kind of got um got the job from within. And it's been great. I work at the uh the Wexter Medical Center as a outpatient pharmacy technician, and it's been awesome. It, it's it's uh working at Ohio State's great. Competing like doing my undergrad at Ohio State was great. Competing at Ohio State was great, and now I'm working at Ohio State, and it's uh, it's been rewarding. Like all all the years I've been there, so it's going well. So you're you're help you still have a role with the club though. You're you're helping the coach. Are you doing what what else is your role with the club? Yeah, I think as far as um, I actually had to do some stuff uh, as far as studying goes for um, like my new job as a pharmacy tech. I had to do uh, a ton of hours of studying for a certification. And so this winter, uh, I was as often as I could stopping into the, uh, the room to kind of roll around with those guys and, uh, help out my coach. Um, while I wasn't an official coach, I just kind of, you know, stopped in and got to roll around with those guys. And, uh, I have old teammates that are still there. So, and they're now leading the club, which is, which is great to see um and yeah that's kind of that was my role with the club now this year and i hope to be growing it a little bit next year and see uh maybe kind of going to some of the opens with them maybe and uh being some of those guys as corners so that's that's uh that's how i'm helping out with the club right now